Hello, hello, all you beautiful faces. Well, you know what time it is. It's time to get some eyes on. Get an eye look on. So when it's the both of us, you know it's two girls and what? What? Two girls and oh, one oh. palette. Hello, she forgot already. That's how long it's been. The beautiful Anastasia Beverly Hills and Jackie Arna collab. Oh my gosh, it's like. Ooh, love it. Ooh, love it. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. One it's of my favorites. Gorge. Yeah, it Jackie, is my this, favorite. I wouldn't have her. I didn't expect any less than this one. So I just think it's gorgeous, yeah, and I'm so excited it. to get in. So we're gonna just go in and do our eye looks and see what we create today. I'm gonna do my um. Get my brushes ready. My powder first, though. Yeah. I'm just using this palette that I always use, that bronzer, and then the the Benefit Cheer palette, and I dab into. <laughs> Gosh, <laughs> air mail. I, I guess, huh? Like, what I was gonna flip that fell out of the top into the Hula in Dallas first thing. I don't know. It's like danger. Oh, Robinson. Well, I want to show you guys one thing since I raved about these brushes, the Morphe brushes. Okay, this is my washed brush. Look at this. Look at this. Okay, do you want to know what this the before of this was? Here's before. Here's after. Do you want to see how sad? That's the thing about the white brushes like that because it's like I guess it's so coarse. Wait, that's the key. hair. Is that it? Nope, this is it. Here it is. Oh, that no. same thing. Like, that's pathetic. I feel like this is ruined for me because I don't use brushes like that fluffy. And I was like, maybe if I flat iron it, it'll like take it back down. But I'm telling you. You cannot use these on a scrubber pad. So if you buy these, don't use them on a scrubber. You have to do it with your, I, rub it between with your, your fingers, fingers like this. only. Just go like this. Only. Very gently. Don't Very gently. Go like that. And I wouldn't recommend using them with dark colors because I, they're just going to get ruined. They're just going to get ruined. Period. Bummer, but true. So I think I'm going to go in, I think I know what kind of look I'm going to do, but I'm just not 100, not 100, not 100 sure what I'm going to do. Mm. Am I going to be able to do one um, look, one without I'm this I'm using the Farrah um, 50F brush. I really like this brush for bronzer now. I don't use um, the, the Luxie one anymore. It just gives a more softer look to the face. I'm going to start. I'm going to start with this one. Oh, and the foundation that I'm using is the L'Oreal Infallible 24 Hour Brush Wear. I love this foundation. I totally recommend it. It's medium to full coverage and I love it. It's like the best foundation I've ever used. That's what I'm using today too. My first time trying my new bottle of it. It was yeah, buy one, she, get one, 50% off, and then I had a coupon, so we got a really good deal on those. Yeah, she tried mine, and it looked really good on her skin, so. Why does this start to dark? Since I went to get replace my bottle, that was, I finally got an empty, and, um, they changed the formula. I didn't like it as much. It just was completely different than when I bought it before. And I can't stand it when a company does that. When they change the formula in between your bottles and the next yeah, one you get doesn't cover the same. It's not, you know, how that it is. Yeah, I hate when companies do that. But yeah, I... I definitely would recommend getting this Cheek Leaders palette by Benefit. It's a really good palette. You get five pans, five full-size pans, and 
Dallas is a little too dark for a blush, so I just mix it in with my bronzer and it gives a really nice glow to the face. Nothing like extreme. I, I love it. I love this palette. Let me go in with big wig. Oh, my eyes are watering. You know, and true to Anastasia palettes, they're very powdery. They are. But what I do is I just tap it, and when it stays, I just leave it there. I don't blow it off. Wait, no, no, no. And then um, I just pick it up in the next in the next application. I'm going to try a little bit of a different eye look for me today. I mean, I'm going to do a halo, but I'm going to do my halo. I almost forgot my nose. Always bronze the nose. You don't want to leave your nose just unbronzed. You have to bronze it so it matches the face. going to go on with the Alomar Cosmetics Blush Palette. This is light and my mom recently just got the medium one so I'm going to mix those together. I actually really love the light. It works perfect for my skin tone. So I'm going to go on with the Luxie Tapered Highlighting Brush. I'm going to go on with the middle and the lighter one. I'm just going to start off with that. I just feel like the her blushes mix so well with my bronzer. Like I don't ever have a problem um, blending it into my bronzer. It just looks so nice and natural. So now I'm gonna go mix the peachy and the center shade and the medium palette. And, uh, I'm actually. Really Going with that, here's your blush palette. I'm gonna go on with my one and only Henri highlight. I just oh, I'm glad that's here. I can use it today. Ever since I got it, my mom got it for me. I just I have a hard time going to other highlights. Which um, who got that for you? My mom. I said what ever since it? ever she since like she got it for me. I my think. amazing, wonderful, thoughtful. Were you gonna add a bunch of adjectives before that? I swear, I thought I heard something come down. My amazing, yeah. wonderful, beautiful mom got it for me. Oh, as a, her house sounds so sweet. As <laughs> an early birthday gift from No Drama Makeup Mama. Yeah, Miss Jeff blessed me with that great deal on that. It's just so pretty and like. You can build it up to be blinding, or you can make it look natural. Um, I'm trying to be a little more light-handed with it today. I don't want something super, super shiny. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now I'm going to spray my face and I have to back up for this. I don't think it's little enough. I'm going to get one of my little more. I want to do this before I apply my eyeshadows just so 
when I go to spray, if I had eyeshadow on and I went to spray, I don't want my eyeshadow to crease, um, which has happened to me before. So now I always do my bronzer and blush before I do an eyeshadow look. Now we can get into the fun stuff. I'm so excited to try this palette. I um, got this palette um, a week ago uh -huh. from my mom. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Amazing, wonderful. It's supposed to come on. A little fucking up would be nice. <laughs> I, I, have, I think you're all you moms know. We all like to be reminded that we they think we're okay, you know. Okay. I'm not sure what kind of look I wanna do. I really, 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 really wanna um use wiggly, that beautiful red shade. But I'm not sure. Um I wanna use the pinks, but that is so cliche of me to use pinks. Um I'm just going to do what I want to do. Whatever. I'm going to go on with um, a little bit of ginger. Just a little bit as my base. Um, I literally barely tapped my brush into that and that's giving me a, a lot of pigment. Which is perfect. That's just the amount I wanted. Oh, I don't want to block my face for me's sake. Sorry, I'll try to hold it away. So how are you guys doing? For those of you who have kids, which I know most of you probably do, are they in school yet or do you still have them? Or have they not started school? Wow. What? That purple is so pretty. I just started school. I started school last week. Oh my eye. Don't even start now, please. Oh, I swear I'm going to cry. And I'm not excited. I'm not one that likes school too much. I'm graduating early, though, so. I'm graduating a semester early. I'm not doing the full year, which is nice. Just because I just don't feel like continuing doing the full year because I have enough credits to graduate early. Um, so right now I'm only taking four classes. I'm taking two English and two um, history-ish classes, economics and government. So, I'm not really a, I'm not a history fan, for those who know me personally, I'm, I don't like history. I am loving this palette so far, it's just like Anastasia's formula, blending amazingly, um, the pigment is amazing as always. I, oh, by the way, I'm using Supreme. I didn't even say what color I was using. It is blending amazingly. I'm having no problems with the blending at all. But man, this weekend has been very busy. It has been so hot out here. It's not even funny how hot it's it been. Really hot. It's like it gets to 100 something out here, and yeah, I just I can't. It's been over 105, about 105. Mm -hmm. That's not as bad as it normally is, but that is. Last hot. summer was pretty um, bad. I'm gonna go into Pinker, the one next to Supreme. I love the color story of this palette. This is my favorite color story Anastasia has ever came out with. I really loved Norvina, but 
I, I just love this one. This one is just amazing. It's totally Jackie on it. It has her written all over it. It just, all these colors just fit her so well. I love Jackie Anna. I watch her. Is so pretty so pretty it looked and the blend is seamless like I'm putting barely any effort into blending it What I don't like about this palette though is that it is limited edition. You once it's sold out, I think for the first couple times they're not gonna bring it back. Which I'm kinda bummed. I wish this palette wasn't limited edition just so for the people who can't afford it now and really want it can get it in the future when they can afford it. So I I do wish it was not limited edition because because when I saw that this came out, I was all bummed because I wasn't going to be able to get it. And then she ended up, someone ended up using a link to, what was it? Well, I had gotten my Ebates. Oh yeah, her Ebates check. She got her Ebates check. Well, so, when you put it on a card, you get more money back. Yeah. And so I always put it on a card. And, um unless they don't offer it because they don't offer it every time they don't offer it on a card to you every time and um so they did this time and i've been with ebates a really long time which is now rakuten which is a really stupid name i really don't like their name now rakuten excuse me rakuten I'm just going in with credit. I'm going to put that on the outer corner. This is by far the easiest brown to work with in the history of browns. It, wow. Do a halo, I think. done a pink and brown look before and I don't know how I'm liking it. I'm going to take big wig and kind of put it on top of the brown to make it a little purpley, like a purple, purpley, purpley brown because I don't like the straight brown. Everywhere with that. Oh, so pretty. So pretty. Oh my gosh, so much better. I am loving this. I love it. So I normally let the purple go all the way over and I'm just leaving the halo to go all the way up to the transition today instead of doing just, the yeah. eye, making it like a tornado up kind of thing. I've seen people do that lately. I hate working with this eye. This eye always gives me issues, always gives me problems when I try to repeat what I did on the other eye. I don't know. Do we all just have that one eye that just doesn't like to cooperate mm -hmm. with us? Yep. And it's 
so happens to be my left eye. This one is not like seeming to. Do you have a. Can I have your settings, buddy? Mixing big wig and credit together makes a beautiful plum. Like an absolutely beautiful plum. Wow. Why does this eye give me such a problem? Look at it. And then compare it to this one. What is that? I don't even understand. Of course, this glitter has tons of fallouts. This eye, it hates me. It hates me. Oh my gosh. Here we go. I'm going to. I'm just going in a little more pink. I'm going to go into. This was my halo, the, the really shimmer color here, but I'm going to go in with the shimmer purple. I'm going to go in down below a little. I just went in with a brush that did not have any product on it, and I'm going over that. I just don't know what's wrong with this eye. See how much know. brighter it is underneath? With the Can I do my... this powder? Uh huh. I need to fix this. I need to fix it. This is in no way the eyeshadow's fault either. This is my left eye, the old new one. Bunny powder is even this. Oh, I will just take a picture with my other. Oh my Honestly, I feel like I have to start over. Look at it. No, oh, it looks good. I'm serious. I'm telling you, it looks good. Don't worry about it. It does look good. She's too dramatic. That's really good. She's being dramatic. I am not being dramatic. Yes, you are. Look good. at the difference. I am not. That is so... Okay. weird my eyes are doing this weird thing lately that this one spot right here in the middle is not the concealer will not stay on it no matter what I do the one spot okay that, that's just gonna have that's, that's how it's gonna
I'm gonna be going with Wiggly. Of course, the side of my nose does not show up because I'm stupid this side to the window. <sighs> oh, I need to do my light jizz. Um, I'm not going to lie. I thought this red was going to be like more, me too, more of a deep red. I'm a little bummed. It's more rust. Than more I... rust. It showed up on Jack Diano like a beautiful deep red, but that's expected because she's dark skinned. But I hate that it shows up like rust on me other. too. I was disappointed about that as well. I'm just, I'm just going over it with this with trust issues. Yeah, I would do like a really bright red under it to you know, pop it all. I feel like I just don't know how to do eyeshadow. Oh, it may very well be. Oh, stop it. Yeah, I don't like that red. I'm sorry. And I do so feel like I wish the palette had one, like, not white. I don't, I don't like white under my brows. I like vanillas personally, but so I'm going to go in my inner corner with Soleil here, which is stunning. Look at that pop. I just took Soleil and I put it on my, on top and um, the look, it looks way better. I'm going to take a little bit more. So I'm going to take, no, I took Zam. I'm taking this away and I'm just going to tap it. Tap it lightly. And I'm doing it just smidgenly under my brows. And I'm going to go back in with a big wig and a little credit. Oh, I love it for the inner eye. Oh my gosh, gorgeous in the inner eye. So back to my favorite lashes, I'm telling you I am so bummed that I cannot find these lashes like at TJ Maxx anymore, I haven't found them in ages. Okay, time to go on to the I don't like, and I'm just going to try and copy what I did on this side, which um, I don't know how I'm going to do, but it's going to happen. Oh my gosh. Did it okay. By the way, this mirror is a Too Faced mirror. I don't think they sell these. She got it free with um, a purchase a while back, and she gave it to me because I saw it in the last Get Ready With Me. Some of you were saying, oh, where'd you get that mirror? It's so cute. It's Too Faced. That yeah, came with a collection. Yeah. Like cheese. I'm trying to get through blinding for this eye here. Yeah, where's my I do like 
she was saying, your glitter, um, the super glittery shimmers do have fall, fall out. My trust issues does have a little fallout. I noticed with the dark shade, you know, like big wig, um, and no, credit had a little bit of fallout. So, Lord. But regardless, I love the mattes. Anastasia never disappoints with the mattes. Never does what? Never disappoints with her mattes. passing out in the shower because I've been dealing with this inner ear inflammation inside my ears and boy it's throwing me for a loop because like I'll be laying there and I'll last night I almost threw up just laying in bed because if the inflammation just hits something all of a sudden you feel like you're gonna get sick and then it happened this morning and it's like you just don't know when it's gonna come on so I'm sorry if I feel I'm a little quiet yeah, I'm quiet too. I just, I don't know what to, you know, talk about. I mean, we've been going through so much recently. You guys kind of know the whole deal. You know, my dad's doing the same. There's not much to update you guys on that, even though I know you guys want updates every yeah. week. But it would just be the same update every week, you know? Because we don't find out anything new for our until weeks. September 16th so I'm which was Nani's birthday Kim's mom's birthday oh. Seriously? Yeah. he goes in on his mom's which is you know she just passed away a yeah, year ago she passed away last and, year um, he gave his appointment on his mom's birthday which was like yeah that's really a smart idea let's give a grieving guy Bad news on his mom's birthday. I, I mean, I'm hoping it's no, going to be good news. it's not going to be bad news. Well, I'm saying I'm hoping it's not going to be bad news, but it's just a loaded day, wrong day to pick. Yeah, I didn't even think about that. Yeah, but oh I don't, for those of you who um, don't follow me on Instagram or anything, I update, I updated you guys there the day of his last appointment, and he didn't, he still has the halo on, he doesn't have a cast or anything, so, and, I updated him. Oh, you did? I didn't know she updated you guys, but... Well, that's bad, bad gal bang for you. This mascara dries out so fast. And it only works for me really well when it's like brand new and it's liquidy. So I have to continually put eye drops in this mascara to keep it the way I like it. But it's my favorite lower lash mascara. Yeah,
Okay. I feel like I look so strange right now because I haven't seen myself with um, this much eyeshadow in a really long time. I feel like I just look super weird. Unless I just did my lower lash line a little too dramatic, but what's the definition of too dramatic anyways? Drag queen? No. They're dramatic. They're they they work to be dramatic. It's not that's well, not that's an true. insult. I'm not insulting drag queens. I'm plain they work at being drama. That's what makes them fun. This is true. And entertaining and fun to watch on stage. Yeah, their personalities just shine through. Not in a bad way. Please don't take that the wrong way. No, the they eyes. make good performers. That's what I mean by I know. that. You know, they are. And they, they're super nice. They have great shows. Yep. I'm using the Thrive Cosmetics Liquid Lash Extension Mascara. absolutely adore these lashes, but I really do wish that they were a bit thicker. So Katie, please, KPO1, just beef them up, baby. For me, please, just for me, you know, come on, we go way back. Yeah. But you can pretend. Do you have eye drops next to you? Um, they're in there, I think. And this mascara is getting a little, uh, it's not very fluffy. I can't find my, um, Dirty little secret one, my favorite. Dirty little secret. What you think? No, she came up with a jingle for dirty little I did. secret. I did, but I, they can't have it because they have to pay me the big bucks for it. My cheeks are a little cheeky today. But I love the color. I did the um, the Too Faced Sugar Rush um, or Sugar Peach palette and mixed in. Oh, I absolutely love the color. But here's my eyes, guys. I love the way my eyes came out today. I think I'm going to do that more instead of doing a smaller halo. I think I like the bigger halo on me for my eye size and everything, you know? Because I've hooded, I think I need to carry it up like that more often. It makes my eyes look bigger, even though they're not. Now this mascara makes me look like I'm wearing, what are they called? False lashes. What she was just talking about. What are they called? 
What are they called? Oh yeah, false blushes. I really like this eye look. And I got all my pink brushes now in here. These are all pink, no pink and gold. And I absolutely love the way my pink brushes, brushes look in here. I wish they were all matching, like, but that's okay. It's it's all it's only um the Jeffree Star Morphe and um gosh, I'm drawing a blank on the name Luxie. The pink Luxie. But one thing I really don't like about this mascara is that it's messy like you guys know I must love this box if I'm keeping it because I absolutely hate taking the palette in and out of it. But I love, I'm in love with the box. Love it. I love, it. I love the box. Oh, I didn't do glow. I didn't do any highlight today. Ooh, so I'm already Hand it over, baby. I'm a breezy. She's an I'm a breezy, I'm a breezy. Well, I am being a hip purposely, thank you. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Every time I see these, I go, why did I give that to her? So I'm going to have to find one somewhere. Look at how beautiful. Oh my gosh. Yeah, they don't carry the Armreezy um, Highlight in store. It's limited edition. Which I think is a big mistake. I don't like a big tiny tiny nose, but I like just a little bit of highlight. Done with mascara. Woo, look at that glow, baby. This highlight looks the best on camera, I have to say. To me, on me at least, this highlight looks the best on when we're filming. No, I, I don't know. I, I like, I, I put others on I like, but no, I, I mean, mean I'm not me, saying it's not the best. I'm just saying I, I've seen other ones that I like it equally as well. But it's just me. Why do I have to do that with it now? I love my Pixie by Petra, which is one of my faves. Sometimes I do things that really just, I question myself. I know this is taking forever, so now see if my hair is still wet. Am I going to be able to do curls? Or will I have to? Oh, what did you do to my table here? Oh, it's mascara. Jeez. I don't even know how I got there. I honestly don't know how it got there. Like a big black blob of mascara on my table. Look at my, this is my lip liner. Yes, this is Dessert First by NYX Cosmetics, and I cannot find it anywhere. So I'm using it until I can't. Until it crumbles apart. But we're going to do our faves next. We're going to do um, our, oh my gosh, what, all of a sudden, look at how light it, look at the color changed. What the heck? Look at oh, it. Oh, like, it's, it's the, it's the what? That's weird. Okay, there, now it goes. It was the charger. Oh, that's shit. very weird. All of a sudden it was like glowing. Wow. Well, what? I what sure happened? I it translate. Um, we're going to do a video of our 10, um, our, I guess you would say ride or dies, like our top 10 favorite palettes, period. And she can even go into my collection if she wants to, um, you know, choose something that she doesn't, wasn't able to own. And then, um, we're going to, um, do our absolute least favorite palettes of what we own. We're probably going to have to go into my sales stuff for that, huh? 
Yeah. I don't really have palettes I hate. I keep ones. No, I, but you don't have any that bug you to no end. Well, yeah, yeah. I have a cup, like a couple, but not like ten. Or well, anything. I think it'll be easier for me to find the ten, but um. And then we're going to do our favorite ten, 10 favorite highlights, our 10, you know, we're going to go through it and do a week of 10s. I love very my eyes came out today. I'm going to use my favorite. I like the Omri Z palette. Love it, love it, love it. Oh, the I took my time today, but um, no, I, I'm sorry. I said Omri Z palette, didn't I? Yeah. I love the Anastasia palette, the Jackie Ina palette what I meant to say. See, Lucas Rain. Can't help it. Sorry. My um, favorite lip combo. I am so excited though to um, get to do. I love that palette. I, I think it's, it's just spot on. Beautiful. It just does the job. It, it does not disappoint. No, um, the I, only thing um, I wish I would personally change is that white silvery color, I would make that a, like a vanilla It color. has a little, it has a gold undertone, but um, yeah, it's not my absolute favorite. But show um, your eyes up close because we got to end it. It's like 46 minutes already. That's what it looks like. It so two girls, one palette. They don't look that good on camera. Mine yes, don't. yours do. Yes, it does. It's it looks amazing. like there's a mist, like the blend is so bad here. It's not that bad. It looks, the it blend looks, looks a lot too. That's amazing in person. And I used Posh for my lips by Mellow Cosmetics. Just these two together are the best combination in the history of lip combination. But thank you guys for sitting through, whoever sat through, and or stayed however long you stayed. We appreciate it. We love you. And we pray that God keeps you safe in this crazy world. Bye. Bye.